Hello, this is Pat for Petresca Papers. I'm out in the Bluebird Bungalow this morning. It's um, late October, and I just watched YouTube, which is my early morning routine, and I found a, a new YouTuber. Her name's Lily. She was making little house envelopes, and it just was like, okay, Pat, okay go out and play. Now, I'm really, really wanting to work on the booklets. This is the gold glitz, golden glitz from Home Sweet Homes on my Etsy shop. They're digital kits and I want to play. I want to play with them. There's just not enough time in the day, but I want to do this. So let's play. We're going to combine my little house digital kits, my home sweet homes, with, you'd got it, junk mail envelopes. So, I have no idea where I'm going. I saw her video, it was inspiring, and out here we trot to see what we can do. I am using the envelopes that come in an envelope, you know, like, we want your money, pay us now, because they're usually a little thinner. This one's a good color because I have two things coming up. I'm going tonight to a book club, and the girl that I'm going to her house mentioned that she was working on a gratitude journal, not a junk gratitude, junk gratitude journal, but you can always put something junky in it. Well, we're going to make it cute. And then my daughter, we're going to her house for Thanksgiving. And I thought, I'm going to do a cute little pouch for her. So here we go. I have sealed this because it was an unused envelope. And then cut this end and cut that end. And we are going to fold them over like that for a good size. And I'm not measuring, I'm just eyeballing. Okay. When I very first came out here and thought of doing, we I would do this, I would, wanted to use my roofs from the digital kit, but that's just not going to work. So we're gonna use just our paper. And you can see I've got plenty of paper. All right, and I would love to make one Halloween, but I think it's going to all be the fallish. Now, what I'm doing is I'm cutting down there, and I'm going just about an inch past, and that's going to be so you can get into your envelope, which is a good thing, you know, if you're going to go to all this trouble. All right, I did not measure. Let's just see if we got it the same, yeah, pretty much. So I'm folding that front down, okay? And I'm going to cut it off. Or am I gonna cut it off? Yeah, I think she cut hers off. If she didn't, I am. I really should fold this over somehow. We'll try that with this next one to see if we should fold it over. Let's try this. Can we fold you down in to give strength? Okay. Cooperate envelope. All right, so we're gonna cut down there. Cutting just past. Let's do it on this side. Probably would, wouldn't be a bad idea to measure. So it's the same on both sides. All right, now this time I am not cutting off the whole thing. I'm just gonna cut off some of it and then fold it and fold it back down on itself. If I, if I do an angle here, then I should be able to. Boy, I'm really good today with these scissors. Let's see, can I fold you back down? It'd be too big of a flap. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, don't tear. Oh, 
Almost, 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 almost. Ooh. I've got a little... There we go. There we go. Just like that. Now, this was from a previous fold, so ignore that. Okay? All right. So, now I've got these two, and they're sort of looking like a house with a different kind of roof on it, just that flat roof. And so then this is going to be for the goodies right down in there. And I, I do like that folded over. We may have to fold some paper over on it. Okay, so now choices. We're going to work on the roof and the back. So I'm going to use... And I apologize if paper that I use, you're going, hey, I didn't have that in my kit. Because a lot of this may not have made the original cut. You know, when I was printing out things, I might have chosen a different paper. Is that one going to work? Yeah, we'll use this. So for our roof, we're going to use this orange should I use because I do want us I want it to go all the way around okay so we're gonna have to do some trimming la la sorry should have been more prepared anyway the home sweet home digital kits it has been phenomenal it I mean I'm just blown away and with how many of you have purchased the digital kits and the responses that I'm getting is that everyone is addicted. Now, I'm I'm seeing the tip of the iceberg. Little houses are a thing right now. Not just my thing. They're a thing that's out there. Everybody is loving making little houses of some kind. So I think what she did is she went down in, and I think we'll do that. So... Let's trim this paper. Did I bring my trimmer out? No, but you know, we're gonna we're gonna tear. What the heck? We don't need a trimmer. We don't need no stinking trimmers. Get this side here. And try to be even. Let's tear. Let's see how even we weren't. So we're, we will put this, oh, did I, I gave it, I didn't tear it enough. All right, well, there's some white on this side. So let's just let's take a smidge off this side so that it can fold down in. Fold, slide, slide, fold. We don't want it to go way far in because that's waste. Okay, just like that. And it doesn't matter if yellow shows on the side of this. Okay, now she used her tape runner and I kind of like that because it's fast and not messy. So we're gonna do that. All right, and then this will fold down here. I have a feeling we're going to have it be a bit of a hodgepodge, uh, collage little envelope. I haven't used my tape runner in a while. And pull that down. Okay. So here is our, where's our fold? Centerfold, yeah, that's the fold right there. And if it's not, guess what? I'm gonna decide where I want it now. Okay, right there. All right, so this is the roof, it opens, you have spots for that. Now let's work on the front that goes around to the back. And we'll just use this same piece that was right on it and since we're tearing let's go ahead and tear again and let's tear this white off let's see if how my tearing skills are this morning not too
too shabby. And I think I'm going to keep this on and tuck it down around this side so I don't care about that white. So let's. Tear you. Do I want to tear it that way? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Eyeballing for a straight line. Boy, is that dangerous. Okay, so let's see. Did I tear you so that you can fit down in? I probably didn't, but let's hope. Let's hope. I had a request from, oh, I can't remember her name, to do a full walk, to, to do a full tutorial on, with the gold kit. And that is on my to-do list. You know, I don't think I even need to glue down in there. No. Ooh, isn't that awesome? Okay, here we go. Tape printer. I've missed you, tape runner. You've been, you've been neglected. I'm getting right to that edge, and I'm overkill. Yes, I am. But I've got tape that's old. I need to use it up. All right, put that down there. Oh, cute. And pull that back up there, and I'll just put another piece there. Okay. Now. Lily was talking about these being great to tuck in junk journals and give them as a Christmas gift. And then she reminded me that I want to do a banner of little houses. And I was thinking, if you saw my video with the, the how I made them half size, would that not be cute to have 25? and have the back be a little pocket for an advent calendar? Yes, it would be. All right, we're gonna go find, oh, look, that's almost perfect. We're gonna use you, and we're, we will cover up a little bit more than is showing with this. And let's, let's get it on there. And I'm not doing any distressing, which is making me crazy. But then I can distress everything later. If you've been doing fun, innovative things with your digital kit and all the papers that come with it, I would love you to comment down below. And if you are just discovering me, Welcome. Uh, please subscribe and ring the bell so that you will be notified when I head out to Bluebird Bungalow. Oh, look at that. And look at that. Holy cow. Now I got to be careful that I don't cut the envelope. But I can cover that up with uh, Distress Ink. Oh my goodness, Pat. Did I just cut the envelope? We'll find out. Okay, there's one. Done except for the decor. And now what do we want to do with this one? For some reason, I keep being drawn to this really, where is it? The really pretty lacy black and the tan. I think let's do it. Let's do it. This would be for my daughter, and she she doesn't run the normal gamut. <laughs> Somehow, she's like her mom, I'm sure. Okay, let's... Oh, do we want to do black? I think we're going to go for the brown, even though the black lace is very pretty. Let's do this brown. We may do the black lace on the roof. Oh, yeah, that's what we'll do. Okay, that's not what the size is. That's not what the size is, Pat. Think, think, think. All right, let's get that lined up. And 
do this. Gonna have lots of these little strips. Gonna have to come up with something to do with those. Oh, I have, I'm sure that we can come up with something. All right, so you're gonna tuck down in there. Yes, thank you, thank you, thank you. We're gonna go down a little bit so that the lining, so as you reach in, you're seeing the lining or the paper like it's a lining in your chest. Oh, again, just. A smidge needed off of there so it'll tuck down in. I'm you I need that pretty out. So I took my smidge off the wrong side. Okay, right down there. Now will you go? Will you cooperate now? Come on, come on, come on. Oh, for Pete's sakes. There we go. Down in there. Good. Have I got enough? To... Yeah. If you look down further, then you get what you get, right? If you're going to go looking for it, you'll find it. All right. And let's fold this over like that. All right. Now we need some tape runner. Now my glue stick is going to feel sad. It's like, you don't love me anymore. Well, I'm not sure I loved you in the beginning, but yeah. It's, oh, I remember you now. You like to grab the paper. Okay, so let's... No, 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 no! See, you are just not nice. Okay. <laughs> are we just loving this no okay you're probably making this roof all wonky now <sighs> don't you love live videos i can just hear everybody clicking go to another channel ah this girl's crazy you down. Let's see if we can straighten you out a little bit. Oh my goodness. There we go. Not too shabby. All right. And then, well, I loved it how I said I could use the black on the roof. Well, this is the roof, girl. So we got a brown roof. And what do we want to do? down here. Do we want to do the black? Oh yeah. Let's just let's just do it. Okay, let's tear some off of this. I'm going to go with the big side. I'm finding that when I tear with the big side with the, where there's more paper, it seems to go easier. I just realized my other light's not on. No wonder I'm in the dark. It helps a little, at least on this end. All right, so again, let's, I just said I'd tear better with the bigger part, but I'm gonna, I am going to do this. All right, and you know, I didn't need to fold that in. I think I'm going to leave the white there. I don't think it's bad. I don't think so. Okay. All right. Let's go for it. Need some tape printer. Maybe if I'm slower and more methodical. Now, this um, YouTuber, Lillian, she does very whimsical looking little houses. Mine tend to be, uh, I don't know if there's whimsy in there. Sometimes. Um, and can I be whimsical? Oh, maybe. Oh, okay. 
I don't want crooked. Now crooked I am. Well, no, I'm not crooked. That makes it sound like I'm a crook. I'm not. I'm not. Okay. Am I am I um protesting too much? Maybe a little bit. Okay, boy. I didn't get cut very nicely. All right, let's put you down. This is that this is that danger zone where you want to grab it. All right, there we go. Just got to pull the right way. Okay, and what is going to go? I think, I don't think this is paper that you have, but just look through and find something you have. This, I don't think, made the cut. I'm going to use the black polka dot. Because who, who doesn't love polka dot? And we will go this way, right? Like that. I could be smart and line it up there, and then I'd have <laughs> a, a straight down there and a straight there. Why would you do that, Pat? Okay. And then you're just a little long for my taste. Let's cut you. I love the polka dots. Give me a, if they've been torn evenly. Let's do that right there. Like that. That's the ticket. So my son from Seattle flew in on Saturday, I guess it was and went to visit friends from years ago when we lived in Georgia the first time. And we got to see him Tuesday because he needed a ride to the airport on Wednesday. I don't, I'm not going to fool myself. I don't think it was any familial thing. It's like, I need to see my parents. I think it was you know, all my friends are working. They can't take me to the airport. I could go stay at my mom's and my mom will get up early and take me to the airport. Oh, he loves me, I'm sure. But he also loves a ride to the airport. Okay. The nice thing about Tape Runner is that it will rub off where other others won't. All right. So we've got two blank canvases now, and I'm sorry, it's screaming, this one at least is screaming for some distressing on that gold. I said I liked the gold, I think I lied. All right, just a little, just a little, bear with me, ooh, that's, I need a little bit of, a little bit of love in there. Let's get that glued now a little bit. So I'm going to use on these houses uh, papers and accessories that came in the digital kit. And I'm sure if you've got the digital kit, you've got windows left over and doors left over. And if you are watching this and you're like, I don't have your kit and I don't want your kit. It's okay. It's really not because you really need it. It's really a lot of fun. But just go through your stash of papers and create a cute house. Honestly, the house the houses are just crazy, crazy big. You know, my 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 original person that I watched was Dol Old Old Ducina with her little little houses. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Ooh, now you know, I've got all this. Oh, that is not a door at all. I'm thinking this may be a door for this one. You know, what I tore off is not big enough. So let's do, let's just tear, let's just tear. 
Oops. Where's my ruler? I think I want, I think that maybe just a little bigger than that. Door. Okay. There's the door and let's make it oh doorish size. Now, do you need to keep watching if you've got this down? No, you can go. Don't go, but go if you need to. Because what we're what I'm going to do is just decorate my little house pocket. Okay. And since we're on a thing with this, even though when it gets smaller, the glue stick does become your friend again. Let's just stick that on there. And I saw a sheet of windows. Where's my windows? Oh, you know, way back when we did this, we organized. I've got windows in here. Let's take out Let's take out this whole little thing. Come join the party. It's a morning party. All right. Let's see. What windows do we want? That's a kind of a big window for a door. Oh, I like you. Let's just go with you. And we're just going to pull out our trusty... Yeah, you worked like a second ago. I didn't put the pin in. No, I didn't. Whenever I leave my Bluebird bungalow, I, I like have to stop as I'm turning off the light switch. It's like, okay, is the distress ink closed? Are my pins and my glue? The mess, I don't worry about. Okay, now we will see some windows there, right? Let's find a matching window. How about you? Oh, I think that's cute. We'll do those. Let's do those two. Why did I do that? I don't know. So I could stick them down one at a time. And let that drew that glue get dry. Oh, you're not too smart, are you, girl? Okay, let's do that. Just making sure we're not going up underneath that roof line. Okay, cute. All right, and then let's. Do we want up there? Let's see. That looks silly. Silly, silly. We'll just use one of these now. That looks sillier. And that doesn't match at all. Oh, what about this round one? Do you see faces <laughs> in your houses? Okay, this woman has gone crazy. Eyeballs, the mouth. Yeah, I don't know. Is that a disease if you see things in your houses? I think we're going to go with the same window. If you see faces in the houses that you make, let me know. I think that's just kind of silly. I've never said it out loud or even verbalized it, but I see how I see faces. Well, I guess it's better than seeing dead people, right? That movie. All right. Now, trim. Oh, the fun part. Oh, you're too blase. What do we want? What do we want? No. It looks like it might need white lace. What do you think? Since we're on a lacy thing, but boy, that just disappears, doesn't it? 
here's a pretty piece of trim. No, I'm not loving it. Okay, come on. What have we got? Ooh, are you? What about you? No, you're the same color. Ha! You need black. You need something black. Out. Ooh. Don't have much of this left. No, two. Okay, I think it's the polka dots. In fact, let's layer. Oh, look what I have. I have a smidge piece. Okay, can we do that with the polka dots? That's a little overkill. Polka dots. I'm going with the polka dots. I'm going to go with the polka dots. And let's get some glue on here. Just like everything else that I do, I have a hard time calling it. You know, it's like, oh, but let's do this. Oh, but let's do that. And I think I'm going to leave a little bit of that brownish gold showing from underneath. Let's trim this off here. Ooh, and look, now we've got all kinds of things. This would be a fun, I don't know, I don't know. It's looking cute. Let's take our other one to that same place, okay? So, door. Do I have a door, a regular door that we could use? Christmas door, Christmas. No, no. Music? I'm thinking, ooh, what's that? Ooh, red glitter, red glitter in my doors? All right, yeah. Let's do the, the music. All right. And let's put this down. So my thought is I'm going to make a big tag to fit down in this envelope that um, the receiver will pull out and you could have a gift card on it, a nice letter tucked into it as a pocket. Um, you know, whatever, whatever you, you want to do. I think I'm going to try to utilize these windows. I don't think I've used these much. Like that. Do I, what about you? You're, yeah, yeah. I think so. All right. You know, I've been toying with a doing a live YouTube. I'm not really sure what that means. I know that I've seen it done with several other YouTubers. I have a feeling it'd be like crickets. <laughs> Listening to crickets. It's like I'd be on and I'm like anybody Anybody here? Anybody here? If you think we could do a live. <laughs> Maybe I should do it on the Halloween and it could be Night of the Dead. But no, if you want to do some kind of a live thing where we all do one of our kits, let me know. I'd like to hear your thoughts. Ooh, look, 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 look. There's a fall wreath that says, I don't look good on that door, so don't do it. Okay, okay, okay. Now we need this upper window. Which one? That one. All right. No, if you would, if you think a live would be something you'd want to do on an evening or, you know, we've got, I'm so excited. I've got people from all over the world. So we've got 
all kinds of time zones that we would have to deal with. But since I'm up in the middle of the night, I would not have a problem with that. Okay. Oh, I put you so close. Didn't leave myself much room for trim. Let's see. I've got this gold. No. Nope. It almost looks like it needs to be green, doesn't it? Would you say so? Would you say? Well, that's kind of law. Kind of law. What? I've got this. Oh, oh. This ribbon I've had for probably 20 years or more. I think you get used today. And the interesting thing is, look at the other side. It's kind of my favorite color, but not on this. All right, let's get some glue on. All right, let's glue this down. Just like that. Let's make sure we didn't glue our flap. All right. Now, I will possibly come back in and do some other things. I was looking at this green I have. It could be like a vine growing up the house. Do we do that? Covering up that window. You know, my first thought is no, but I'm going to do it. I am going to do it. I'm going to reach in here, cut off that, and this is going to be the challenge. So I'm going to put glue on this. I'm not going to put it on the leaves. Oh, come on. Lay flat. Boy, can you feel disaster coming like I can? Oh, there. Lay you down. Don't curl up on me. I need a third hand here. One of you jumped through the screen. Help me. Ah, okay. Now, this is probably the disaster. Let's grab you there. Talk about disaster. Yesterday I went to reach for something and I had just been congratulating myself, should never do that, on having my nails look good without, you know, spending money. And lo and behold, I smacked this, something I was reaching for and broke nails. Don't look, don't look now that I pointed it out. And let's try to reach that. And we're going to cut off this. I don't know why, but we're cutting that leaf off. Cute. Okay. Now, you. What, is there another? Is there something else we could do cute for you? I kind of... Messed up that being a wreath on there, but I still could do it. I kind of like it. Covering up the window. Well, that's what a wreath does a lot of times. Okay. And I think for our purposes, our little house is done. And I'm not doing anything to the back. It's just pretty. You know, you have a pretty envelope you give people, and it's not got, it doesn't have things written all over it. So we can have a pretty back to this. Ooh, you do need something. I know, I know, I know. Where is it? Where is it? Oh, don't tell me I'm not gonna be able to find you. Where are you? I have a green rose that I cut out of some some ribbon I have, and it's like 
Oh, it doesn't go with that. It doesn't go with that. Do I even know where that roll of ribbon is? Oh, don't fail me now. If you saw what I'm looking through, you'd go, hmm, I wonder if she can't find anything. She's got stuff everywhere. Do I know where that green ribbon is? Oh, there it is. There it is. There it is. Now, won't it be sad if this is the wrong color? It is kind of, but we're going with it. Again, this is, I have a, a bit of pink of this that I bought years ago. It is so pretty and it was so expensive. It's like, oh, I can't use that. I don't know how to use it. What do I use it for? You're saving it to cut up in little pieces. Put it on a house. Can I tuck you in here? I think that's okay. Uh, do I? I'm not so sure. I'm not sure now. Don't you love it? Okay, we're going to say that's that's done-ish. And let's put our pin in our glue. That's somewhere right here. And I'm just going to quickly look at the tag and how to do that, in case you're wondering. All right, let's get the windows back in their container, which is a an unusual thing for me to do to put something back yeah yeah I'm sorry the squirrel ran through that mean old squirrel this just looked like please I want to be part of the I want to come to the party I didn't get glue right there. There. So what should I put in this for my friend with her gratitude journal? I think just a little note about how grateful I am for friends. Maybe find a quote about friends. This one will probably have something about family. And that does need a little something up on the top. Look what I found. Man, you should have been down there. You should have been down there. I don't think I love you up at the top. This that we talked about earlier. Oh, you know, why not? It's just, it's just a thing. Okay. Glue. Glue. You're on. Right. Is there a right and a wrong? Is there a right and a wrong? I think that's wrong, but I think I like it. I like that little bit of black that's into the white. Okay. All right. Now, really, honestly, let's talk about tags. I have in my little envelope... What if I got card stock? Because it's if you're going to do a tag, it's going to need to be card stock. You know, I think I can use this piece. And again, if you're looking through your kit saying, I don't have that paper, you might not. Because these were things that I was, I, that as I was creating I, they didn't make the cut. All right. So, it seems like you should be trimmed with a trimmer. Let's see, do I have a trimmer right here? Yes, I do. All right. So, this would be a good time to measure. Let's do a measure. Oh, I hate this ruler. I mean, I love it, but I hate it. Because as it's clear, it just disappears. Okay, well, there's a four. So we know it's not four. And it's probably not three and a quarter. It's probably just a little bit less. But I'm going to go three and a half just to make sure it will go into my pocket. And I'm going to trim off 
this this trimmer where I trim just seems wrong. It's this line and I never remember. Okay, so three and a half. Okay, and then let's do this one over here. Let's get you lined up there. More long strips. Where's three and a half? Three and a half. Three and a half. Or two and a half. It's two and a half. Is it? Yeah, it is. So what is it? I'm confused. I am so confused. Well, there's three and a half. This trimmer confuses the heck out of me. All right, there we go. More strips, more strips. Okay, let's see. Now, length. This one is going in here. In case you were wondering, it's like, Pat, that looks crappy in that other one. We'll go down there. And I want it to poke up. <gasps> yes, there is a reason there's a ruler. All right. Bottom to top is six and a half. All right. Let's go six and a half. Boy, you've got some ugly lines in you. We'll cover it up. Let's trim off that white and let's go. Okay, come on. Let's open up. Let's go six and a half. This way, this way. Six and a half. This will be the tag. Okay, come on. There is that. No. How did I get them come up with six and a half? How long did you go? How long are you? Okay, I am so challenged with this ruler. All right. Yeah, that's six and a half. Didn't we measure six and a half? We did. But you're too long. I guess we have to account for bulk down in there. That's just weird. I don't think it's stuck on anything. Yes, it was. Okay, so six and a half it is. And I'm, I will, I have this awesome tool I'm gonna, re, I'm gonna rely on right now, but definitely cut your corners. And then gotta get over that. What is it that's causing that down in there? Aha! It's where I didn't glue the envelope very well. Let that be a lesson. Glue your envelope really well. Okay, so there's that. And let's do this other one really quick, and then I'm going to let you go and have a day. Yes, I am. All right, so six and a half was correct. Oh, how many tools can we get out at one time? And how many will fit on my desk? Okay, well, and then you put away the one you need. Okay. Right down in there. Envelope stopping you? I don't know. Is it stopping you? I don't think so. I think this time I didn't measure this one. I think it's a little shorter. Let's make it a little shorter. Not too much shorter, but some. Okay, right like that. All right. I think this is where I'm going to say adieu to you and you and you and um, tell you I will be back. 
So if you haven't subscribed and you like what you saw, please subscribe, ring the bell, comment, thumbs up, all those things. And I will be back. Probably the next one will be that full tutorial using the Golden Glitz Home Sweet Home. So again, if you are interested in knowing more about the kits, the digital kits, they are available at my Etsy shop, which is Patreska Papers, P-A-T-R-E-S-K-A-P-A-P-E-R-S dot Etsy dot com. And I'd love to see you there and I'd love to see you come back here. Take care. Have a good day. Bye-bye.